We're on the Brady stand, and as usual, they have a lot of very, very pretty drums. This is a Mary Fiddleback veneer over a Mary shell. This is a Jaraply kit finished in Halls Creek. Halls Creek apparently is a town in northwest Australia. And it's a, a very, very pretty, very, very pretty veneer. This is a prototype on the, on the Brady stand. This is spotted gum, which apparently is twice as hard as Jarra, which is already pretty, pretty tough. Now the badge is actually made of 17 individual pieces of wood. Those aren't stained bits of wood, they are 17 different sorts of wood cut into very small pieces. Uh, this is a thinner shell because the wood is so hard, um, which sort of gives it a, a, about an, a third of an octave lower than a traditional Brady kit. Brady have reintroduced the Wandu block shells. It's 30 years, believe it or not, since the Love Shack uh, track was released, and that was recorded using a 12 by 7 Wandu block, and this is one of the more modern ones. This is the Kosaka snare. Kosaka was a friend of the Brady's, who was very influential in, in getting the, com the company sorted out. This is a stave bamboo shell, available in 4.5, 5.5, and 6.5. This monster is a 16-inch spotted gum. You can see how big that is. That is a normal-sized drum stick resting on the head. It is enormous, uh, but it is incredibly sensitive. Again, it has the badge made of 17 pieces of timber. 